This world is filled with sinners and cynics. Menaces, mimics, my niggas die by the minute. What you wanna do with all of that privilege? Find you some business, probably invest in your vision, huh? Pretend like you don't recognize remnants yeah. yeah. of slavery, savage, it's still sadistic eugenics. Uh. Ain't never been a plot to your lineage, and that's just the premise. For one of years they've been pimping. Uh. Laws is not the finest to prison, what them kill make us sicker. Sex, cigarettes, and liquor. Uh. We knew well, we alchemy, they stole the elixir. Now they control yeah, religion, and they plagiarize scriptures. Nah, nah, I can't fuck around with these bitches I'm about to burn me some bridges Let y'all burn crosses in history Uh, I do this for my brothers and sisters For my allies and mixtures Who you gon' raise a fist for? A hundred shots minimum for melanin like mine Spine tingles from siren speakers White sheets of different varieties Now lean and slain Blood Blood lost in veins Brain can't wash these streets, so I must must. With crushed memories of future goals never accomplished Hate beginning to reap from boys Eyes more demon than oppressors The stressors of life too dark to distinguish between devil and dirt Who am I? Who are we? Tell me what's the verdict. Too much Parkinson's in our speech, but tongues can stand to steal. Do we care? I don't know. Only for the hashtags and body bags, still undeclared homicide. But we are awakening. We are. When has a movement ever had 100% stand for equilibrium for whatever position suits you before they shoot you and your family must suit you for your last gathering? Are you willing to take it further? Now it's time for action. Tell me what's the verdict. I say, tell me what's the verdict. Heard they taking shots, committing murder. Committing murder. Well, we gon' take it further. I said, we gon' take it further. Spitting disease, hope they allergic. Tell me what's the verdict. Yeah, yeah. That is the track, Take It Further, from our debut EP, Mother Nature. Yes, yes. Um, definitely uh, a song that can relate to the times and everything that we going through as black people, um, as all people, you know what I'm saying, losing our friends and our loved ones. So. Yes, and y'all are in tune with Mother Nature. This is clever. Yeah. I am truth. You catch us at mothernaturebars.com. Again, mothernaturebars.com. What is he? What is he on it? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yo, yo. This yo, is yo. also from my EP. Uh. Mother uh, Nature. Uh. Yeah. Yeah. Like a Michael Jackson. Yeah. Like a Michael Jackson. Like a Michael Jackson. Like a Michael Jackson. Like a Michael Jackson. Why you mad? Cause I'm Michael Jackson. Yeah. Say I'm bad. Say I'm bad. Say I'm bad. Yeah. Say I'm bad like I'm Michael Jackson. White or black like I'm Michael Jackson. Beat that ass like I'm Michael Jackson. Why you mad? Cause I'm Michael Jackson. Say I'm bad like I'm Michael Jackson. Why the black like I'm Michael Jackson. Beat that ass like I'm Michael Jackson. Why you mad? Cause I'm Michael Jackson. I be that ass. smooth criminal. Love is unconditional. Tell them it's human nature as long as it's unforgettable. But that's another part of me. Artistry all in my arteries. I don't do this shit partially. Uh, and they hate that fact. Fuck your contract. We know it's all sand traps. Money, I can make that back Cause my soul and my spirit is still intact Relax, why you so high strung? Speak with a devil's tongue about popping the gun I'm really trying to help our young Spit so much cold, think I caught black lung Yeah, really work a dead night Like Kate that said, man, we gon' be alright Really work a dead night Like Kate that said, man, we gon' be alright And I'ma put my life down Cause they trying to kill us all, poor black and brown uh. Old hood like a ghost town How we kings and queens with bullets in a crown Wow, is it scary? Bloody fuck without, without the cherry Praying for them long shots, no, no Hail Mary Wanna help while you act so contrary So deep in the white, you should call me very Tell me that I should bite my tongue Now that I see where we can be and what they've done Been losing sleep over these dreams since I was young Get on my feet and I'ma hit these streets and run yeah. 
If it wasn't for my dad, I would've never practiced. Always had me in the lab, 93 rap shit. He gave me the gift of gab, and before it was a fad. Before the culture got mad and took everything we had. Him and his homies mad, him and my mommy smashing. That was established. His bastard kid, he packed it in the blackest skin. His acumen was accurate, immaculate, ejaculate. My silky naps and shit. Look at me now, my jacket zips, my slacks and slips. No lacking this, no activist. Just pass the piff and pass the fifth. And look at me drunk. I thrust my hips, don't trust no bitch like Billy G. She spilled the beans and cuffed the wrist. Uh, now I need those like I need, need like I tease those like I need bows. I don't need those. I can smell the pussy on these weak hoes. I can tell they looking with my eyes closed. Before you get it started, it's finito. Oh, motherfuckers dead on my arrival. I've been smoking on some sour diesel. Yeah, that's probably why my eyes low. And I ain't had sleep. Uh, all I do yeah, is work. Yeah, all I do is work. Yeah, all I do yeah. is reap. Say I'm bad like I'm Michael Jackson. Uh, Why the black like I'm Michael Jackson? Beat that ass like I'm Michael Jackson. Why you mad? Cause I'm Michael Jackson. Say I'm bad like I'm Michael Jackson. Why the black like I'm Michael Jackson? Beat that ass like I'm Michael Jackson. Why you mad? Cause I'm Michael Jackson. Hey, hey, hey. Yes, yes. Michael Jackson, you can find that on SoundCloud, iTunes, Spotify, yeah, yeah, yeah. all of that. Do it. Yeah. Yeah. Let me play. Shout out to Rock Boy. Yo. Do it. Yo. Shout out to Let Cilla Cole. Yeah. Yeah. Do it. Yeah. Do it. Let me play your afro like that. You know what I want to do. You can lay your afro like that. So that's yeah. quick. Do it. Let yeah. me play your afro like that. You know what I want to do. Let me play your afro like that. You know what I want to do. Do that. I weave in and I weave out and that's it, and that's it. I 
how we been and how we vow and that's it and that's it how we been and how we vow and that's it and that's it how we been and how we vow and that's it and that's it how we been and how we vow and that's it and that's it how we been and how we vow and that's it and that's it how we been and how we vow and that's it and that's it Yes, yes, that is Afro. Afro, remix. the remix produced by Rockmore of the Great Thinkers. And them beautiful vocals you heard with Cela Cole. Much love, much love. Yeah, yeah. Damn, what we got next on this one? Oh, we still got a little talking time then. All right, shit. Okay, let's do it. <laughs> what you want to talk about? Shit, movement, movement. Movements. Movements. If y'all don't know what that is, it's about the culture. It's about pushing forward. It's about doing doing what this means right now. Giving y'all the antidote, you feel me? Spreading peace and love, peace yes, and love yes. all day. Yes. So, uh, so, uh, if y'all feeling low, we're gonna give y'all an antidote. Rolling through the city looking for the antidote. Rolling through the city looking for the antidote. Uh, call it dope, man. I hope he open. I need a dosage, I'm on it, go, go, go I need a healer, a soul keeper, a leader Release the dreamers, make them all believers Go deeper, dirt it, I'm a chicken Flow with every sentence, cause it's like it be a prison If you lacking on your vision, hey Tension, ain't no difference getting lit To them pills your doctor sent, please don't be that ignorant Pharmaceutical companies just got laws in they pocket Prices steady skyrocket and then they reap all the profit My man's got a gram in his wallet and can sit down at the station House the rest while he waiting, family using all of they savings Praying to the Lord they can save him, easier said than done Government already won, another soul for the slum I can see the beauty in pain. Ask me what I do in the pain. It's my duty not to do this in vain. All this broke that opportunity bring. All this broke that opportunity bring. Hey, I can see the beauty in pain. Ask me what I do in the pain. It's my duty not to do this in vain. All this broke that opportunity bring. All this broke that opportunity bring. Rolling through the city looking for the antidote. Rolling through the city looking for the antidote. Hey, call it dope, man. I hope he open. I really do. I need a dosage. I'm on it. Go, go, go. Loose change. Couple dollars for a new strain. What you charging? Going through things. Living lawless, making do things. Living honest, making moves, though. Limonada with the juice, ho. Might have to call two brains. I need a charger for the boost, though. Life got me, give me gusto. Life taught me how to move slow. Life caught me for the view blow. But it brought me closer to the true me. Mother Nature turning new leaf. Burning new leaf, earning new leaf. I've been patient for a few weeks. Got some new beats in my crew flee. I've been facing situations lately with some new peace. Cause I know God. I've been praying on a daily basis. I improve me, I improve y'all. Give me grace while I integrate. Let me ventilate my lungs uh, Give me grace while I'm in the bed Everything is great Let me see what's up with the plug I can see the beauty in pain Ask me what I do in the play It's my duty not to do this in vain All this growth that opportunities bring All this growth that opportunities bring hey. I can see the beauty in pain Ask me what I do in the play It's my duty not to do this in vain all this growth that opportunity bring. All this growth that opportunity bring. Rolling through the city, rolling through the city, rolling, rolling, rolling through the city, we be rolling through the city, rolling, 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 we on it, go, hey. Movement. <laughs> Much love, y'all. We are Mother Nature. Once again, MotherNatureBars.com. Catch everything that you need, all the social medias. Catch the Mother Nature EP on iTunes, Spotify, self-titled, all that. all that good shit, man. Check us out, man. The movement is here, man. So, Mother Chicago, Nature what bars. up? <laughs> Appreciate y'all time, man. Much love. Peace and Peace love. And love. WLUW is pleased to welcome this duo of thought-provoking Flat girl geniuses. This is Mother Nature. Thank you guys for joining us. Thank you. Thank, thank you for you. having us. How are you guys doing? Awesome. Great. Yeah. Beautiful. <laughs> um, tell me how your week has been. Oh wow. Movement. A lot of movement. 
Yeah, exhilarating. Um, yeah, we've been in New York for the past week. We only got back like a day ago, two days ago, something like that. Yeah. And uh, yeah, so New York was just how we imagined. A lot of movement, a lot of mm -hmm. networking, a lot of working. So it's been great, though. Yeah. Was it your first time there? My first time, yeah. yeah as a group, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. um, so you are both independent artists on top of the Mother Nature uh, group. Can you tell me a little bit about how you two met? Yeah. Good old story. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> we actually met back in college. Uh, we were both in a uh, organization called Word. And shout out Word. Shout out. <laughs> uh, and yeah, we started like obviously like working together in that realm. Um, but then after graduation, uh, I was pretty much working with my collective, The Great Thinkers, and she was doing her thing uh, with her collective and doing a lot of shows downtown. And we ended up getting asked to do uh, the Pygmalion show. Uh, was it 2015? Yes. Um, that we got asked to do it. And it was originally like we could choose how we wanted to do it, if we wanted to split the set, um, if we wanted to share the stage. You know, it was up to us. Um, and then we decided to work on a project together to perform for Pygmalion, and it ended up, you know, turning into a group, so. Yeah. <laughs> Pretty much the synopsis. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah it's, it's, a, it's a much longer story than that, but that's the short version. Yeah. And uh, what did you guys study in college, and how did you fuse what you were studying with hip-hop? Um, mm, that's a good question, the fuse part. Um, yeah, I study community health. Like, I, I have a bachelor's in community community health, uh, health administration and education. Um, only my senior year last semester that I f realized I did not want to do that. Um, but it's like my main goal was just like to help people. And I guess like in my music, that's that's what I talk about is what she talk about when we like just healing ourselves and then it helps other people. So I guess that's the way that I we can fuse it. Or how I, I see that we fuse it is like just speaking our truths and then it, it helps other people. So Yeah. And I studied creative writing, uh and sociology. Um so in the same way uh, I wasn't exactly doing like writing for, you know, hip hop in school, but it definitely helped my writing. And again, like just the networks, I guess, that we've made in college and things like that more so serve the music than anything. Um, but yeah, I definitely, I write a lot, you know, I write a lot, I try to write stories and hip hop is definitely about the storytelling, so. Mm -hmm. And how is the hip hop community different in like a medium sized town in central Illinois compared to Chicago? <laughs> Much different, <laughs> much different. That's why um, we're here. <laughs> it's just like it's just that it's it's more like we we got to get into little pockets of the different artists that are in Chicago and in Champaign. It's like it is a plethora. Don't get me wrong, it is very dope artists and like it is a community, but it's not so much that like we band together in Champaign the way they do in Chicago. So I think that's the main thing is that like the community aspect and then just the amounts of like artists, the different types and stuff like that. So that I think that's the main thing, just the community aspect and then the quantity for the most part. Yeah. Are there any perks of making hip hop in a small town? Like, do you feel like you can take more risks because there's not as much as many eyes on you? Mm. For me, um, I think that is is done a lot to like hone my like originality. Um, just being from a place where I kind of stuck out. So I would say in that aspect, but also, yeah, like that's where we both built our fan base, our, you know, initial fan base. And so um, it's good for that reason. Like it's, it's definitely easy to, s to stick out in a smaller community. Um, we do a lot of community work as well. So uh, that's easier to do in a smaller community. You have a lot of support um, and people, you know, a lot of visibility, so. And like, about a year ago when you told people that you were making hip-hop like if you went to chicago and new york and you told people that you were making hip-hop in champaign illinois what would they say to you <laughs> where is that <laughs> what are you talking about <laughs> i mean they still say that <laughs> a year ago I mean. yeah that's tomorrow yesterday <laughs> like, like they still don't know what champagne is i barely know like and i, I gotta be there. like you of i you of i uh. yeah sometimes they don't even get them <laughs> two hours like away from chicago yeah. what i normally say um, so you guys are working on a hip hop nonprofit for youth. Can you tell me a little bit about that? Oh yes, yeah. yes, yes. Um, it's well, it's uh, it's Mother Nature Incorporated. Um, that's the the overall thing about it. And what we're doing 
is pretty much doing hip hop workshops uh, for the youth. Uh, we've been doing the work for about a year and some months or a year and a half now. Before we became a group. Really. Yeah, yeah. Before we became a, a group, we just was in the same arenas for the most part and we just like hey let's just do the work so um yeah but pretty much we're just doing uh workshops based around uh social issues based around like uh self-esteem like anything that helps the kids for the most part be able to express themselves creatively and freely mm -hmm. um one of our mentors and home girls and like low-key mother <laughs> and all that she type rose. of stuff yeah uh dr uh, ruth nicole brown she's a professor at u of i and uh she does this uh group called uh well not really a group but this entity called soul hot and it's uh saving our lives here our truths and what she does is pretty much uh just work with with girls in high schools middle school things of that nature and allow them to just be themselves creatively express themselves so we just uh utilize what she was doing and just uh, added the elements of hip hop. Yeah, you know? for the most part. So, like like you said, we've been doing this for before we were Mother Nature, and we just carrying it on and just trying to make it a thing where we can just be our own bosses. So it's like, why not just make it a nonprofit and try to just build from that? So mm -hmm. and mobilize it, make it nationwide. Yeah. And where can people donate to that uh, organization? MotherNatureBars.com. Mother Nature okay. Bars with a Z. Yes. <laughs> um, so what do you guys have planned for the future, just in your own lives or for shows? Traveling, releases? Grammys, <laughs> baddies. Uh, now, yeah. uh, we, I know that we want to do a lot of collaborating in Chicago. Definitely. Uh, you know, that's part of the reason why we're here is to just really get in this community that's, um, that's emerging yeah. and that's been here. So collaborations, uh, working on uh, another project after movement, um, a, a much more like live organic project. Um, what else? I mean, just for the main part, just continuing to inspire, continuing to like put our music out to the forefront, just show people like just put our energy out there to show people that they can do what they want to do. Because I feel like Mother Nature is that is that. We, we just two girls that just came together and we love hip hop, this is what we do. And just showing people that you don't need like, you know, a million dollars to get out here and do what you do what you want to do. Just so speak your truth, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Speak so what just, you know. Yeah, continue to just, just to inspire people and just make them feel and know that they can do whatever that they put their minds to. Yeah. And if you could collaborate with any Chicago artists right now, who would that be? I mean, so many chance Mick Jenkins, Saba, Saba. <laughs> uh, no, no name, name. Uh, everybody <laughs> for real, like everybody. Yeah, everybody. It, it seems like it's a renaissance right now. Oh yes, oh totally. yes. Um, and what's your favorite place to hang out in Chicago, or just to be? The crib. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I like the water, so it's cold right now, but I like the lakefront. Yeah, totally. Yeah, uh, yeah like Jamila Woods. Uh, have you seen her album mm -hmm. cover? Oh that yes, was taken yes, in. yes. The lake. We want to. We cool. want to work with her too. Yeah, yeah no, she's really cool. <laughs> Hope she knows that. <laughs> maybe, maybe she'll watch this. Yeah. Well, thank you guys so much. This has been Mother Nature on WLEW. Hey. Peace and love. <laughs>